Hello everyone. Today our topic of discussion is the company called LifeCore Biomedical. I'll enlighten you with the financial aspects of it and at the end of the video you'll gain insight into whether it's advisable to invest in the company or not. In the realm of pharmaceutical development and manufacturing, the company has long stood as a beacon of innovation partnering with clients to bring life-changing medicines to fruition. Over decades, their dedicated workforce has worked tirelessly, supported by robust infrastructure to deliver on promises and impact lives positively. However, recent market fluctuations have cast a shadow over their trajectory. With a significant drop of minus 46.12% in stock price, sentiments have turned bearish, prompting speculation about the underlying reasons. Despite historical revenue growth of 16.1%, profitability remains elusive, with net income declining by 71.4% over the past five years. As their balance sheet undergoes shifts with diminishing assets and shareholders' equity, attention is drawn to their debt-to-equity ratio, highlighting the delicate balance between growth and financial stability. The company's total assets have increased steadily over the past five years, from $404.70 million in 2018 to $277.81 million in 2022. This is a decrease of 31.2%. And its total liabilities have decreased steadily over the past five years, from $248.95 million in 2018 to $187.11 million in 2022. This is a decrease of 25.3%. Amidst these challenges, signals of potential liquidity issues and resource inefficiency emerge, calling for introspection and strategic realignment. To conclude, I would like to say that LifeCore Biomedical is a risky investment because of the following points. Significant drop in the past day, which is minus 46.12% with the bearish sentiment. Downward trend since the beginning of the year. Revenue growth, but still not profitable with negative operating and net income margins. Operating expenses declining, but not rapidly enough to offset losses. Their total assets and shareholders' equity decreasing, liabilities decreasing, but debt-to-equity ratio still relatively high. Current ratio below the recommended benchmark indicating potential liquidity issues. Low asset turnover and inventory turnover suggesting inefficient use of resources. And lastly, negative profitability margins highlighting ongoing losses. Yet, amidst the turmoil, opportunities for innovation and adaptation abound, reaffirming their steadfast commitment to improving lives. As they navigate these turbulent waters guided by resilience and determination, they remain poised to emerge stronger, driven by their unwavering dedication to making a meaningful difference in the world. If you would like us to research a stock, Please tweet at Collective Re-C or leave a comment here. Like and subscribe for potential investment ideas. Become a member at www.collective-research.com and receive our research reports before they are published.